Hey guys, it's me again, Cheryl, that girl, coming to you with a CVS haul for the week of March 13th through March 19th, 2016. Let's get into some savings. My first transaction included these two Garnier wipes. Uh, they're on a special this week when you buy any two Garnier. They're going to give you a $5 extra care buck back. So I bought those two along with two of these Salon Paws. These are buy two this week as well. And they're giving you a $5 extra care buck on those. Along with two of the Colgate Totals. They're on a promotion where if you, they're three thirty nine dollars this week. And if you buy one, they're going to give you a $2.50 extra care buck that you see right there. If you buy two of them, which it is a limit of two per card, they're going to give you $5. So you get $2.50 for each one. Um, along with that, on that transaction, I bought one of these nuances because they're only $3.12 in my store. No extra care book, but I had a $3 coupon that came out of a beauty booklet that they gave us months and months ago in, in one of the stores that I shop in. And so with that $3 coupon, it made it $0.12 cents for that. So that was an awesome deal because these were on sale for like 75% off. So that just shows you how much it costs normally. Um, and basically, I also got one of these Crest, the Crest Pro Health and the Crest 3D are $3 this week, but they're giving you a $2 extra care buck back for each one that you buy. You can buy two of those as well. Um, so on that transaction, I got the one, uh, Crest Pro Health. I use a dollar off coupon. It expires on 326.16 that we got on the newspaper, uh, last month, I believe. I also, um, used two of those $2 printables. On the Colgate that we got, they were on coupons.com. There was $2 off each one. As well as that $2 coupon that we got weeks ago that CVS gave us on a Sunday. Um, this particular coupon was on the Colgate Total, Max Fresh, and a few other Colgate ones. Anyway, that coupon expired on the 28th of February. Today is the 14th day to use it. So if you have that $2 coupon that I'm referring to, today's the only day you can go get this deal. But if you do have that coupon, you can use two of those $2 coupons from coupons.com plus that $2 coupon is going to take $6 off of the, uh, cause these are three thirty nine, so it's gonna take six dollars off to six eighty. Basically, making eighty cents for both of them out of pocket, but they're gonna give you five dollars back in extra care bucks. So if you have the, all those coupons, it's a really good deal on that. So I did all those things plus the Garnier, and I'm gonna show you my receipt. There's my manufacturer's coupons. There's my bucks right underneath the manufacturer's coupon. There's my $3 coupon on the Nuance, my 3 off of 15 that I had on facial from the coupon machine, and that $2 off select uh, Colgate that I was telling you about. You see, my subtotal was only $0.22, cents, and with tax, it was $1.43 total, which is awesome. And from that transaction right there, I got $17 in extra care bucks back. I took that $17 and rolled it into my second transaction. <laughs> excuse me, which I'm going to show you is right here. Um, I bought um, two of the Glade starter kits. These are in CVS this week. They're $3 a piece. They're going to be two for three. Oh, excuse me. These are $5. Sorry. The starter kits are $5. And the candles are two for $3. I mean, two for $6. So they're $3 a piece. Anyway, in this week's ad, there's a promotion. If you spend $9 on Glade, they're giving you a $3 extra care book back, like what you see there. So I used some of those coupons I told you about. Remember, I got from Rachel Ray and Martha Stewart magazines. Um, remember I told you the great thing about subscribing in some magazines, you get coupons every once in a while. So I got used some of those coupons again. <clears throat> and I also got another nuance on this transaction. So I took another $3 off. I'm going to show you the receipt right here. There's a receipt right there. Oh, and I forgot to tell you. On the uh, Sally Hansen Miracle Gel uh, nail polishes, they're $9.99. And this week in CVS, and there's two of them right there. This week in CVS, if you spend $10 on Sally Hansen products, they're giving you a $5 back. So for each one that I got, I got $5 back off of each one. Because remember, if you're with a few pennies, the coupon, I mean, the system will usually give you the bugs. So 
Here's a receipt for that one. There's all my Glade products. And there's my Crest. I got another one because it was $3 and get $2 back. And remember, you can do it twice per card. And I also got two of the bottles of Listerine. They're $2.99 this week. Here they go right here. And I had a dollar off coupon on each one from the coup uh, from the newspaper recently. And I also had a $3 off coupon that CVS gave me on those as well. And I'm going to show you all the coupons that I had for this transaction. Okay, so there's the coupons. I had a dollar fifty off five on air freshener. You know that's a CVS one. As excuse me, two dollars off six on the Listerine. Three dollar off fifteen on that cosmetic coupon that we got recently that everyone got uh, a couple Sundays ago. There's all my manufacturer's coupons. Um, and there's my CVS bucks that I rolled into it. I rolled the seventeen dollars from the first transaction. Ended up, uh, subtotal only being 58 cents. That darn tax got me again, but it's okay. Because from this transaction, I got three from the Glade. Two from the, um, Crest. And then I got ten from the, um, Sally Hansen. So I got $15 back from this transaction. I rolled in the sub part of it into my next transaction, which is right here. I bought two Crisco oils two Domino Sugars, and another Nuance. And so these are the Domino Sugars. These are two for six dollars this week, as well as the Crisco Oil and CVS. So that's a really good deal. And like I said, I got another Nuance as well. I didn't have any coupons on the Nuance. I mean, excuse me, on the Crisco or the Domino Sugar, but because I had that $15 from the previous transaction, I rolled uh, 13 of it into this. Excuse me, 12 of it into this, and I use that $3 Nuance coupon. You see, my subtotal was only $0.12. Cents. With taxes and everything, I paid $0.67 cents out of pocket, which was awesome, awesome, awesome. So there was no bucks after this, but you see all that I was able to roll for the bucks that I had. I started out with 17 and I was able to roll all this stuff on the $17 uh, e-books that I started out with. So that was um, on that card. On another card, I'm going to show you something that I did as well. Um, where is it? On another card, I bought these. The Honey Nut Cheerios are $1.88 this week. I bought two Colgate. I bought a Crest. And I bought another Nuance because, like I said, they're on sale. They're clearanced out. I had the coupon. Um, I had the dollar coupon on the Col. I mean, excuse me, on the... Um, Crest, two dollar on the Colgate, another dollar on there. I hadn't didn't have any more um, printable Colgate, so I had to use a dollar one that I had, and then I had a dollar on the cereal. I had also the CVS dollar off two. I had um, the two dollar Colgate one that I was telling you about that expires today if you're going to use it, meaning there you won't be able to use it after today because it, you won't even it be fourteen days past due. Uh, after today and there's my few little bucks that I had anyway my subtotal on this one was 266 but I ended up getting like uh let's see I got what was it seven dollars back on this because there's five off the Colgate and two off the yeah off the Crest so it was seven dollars and that was a really good deal on that as well um on another card I basically did the Crest the Nuance, and it was something else that I did. And the Colgate, I got two Crest, two uh, uh, Colgate, and the Nuance. And you see right there, my subtotal is $1.51. Because on this particular card, it was an old card, but I had that $2 Colgate, so I wanted to use it. But I still got $6.50 back from this. So it just made it a really good deal, because I got four off the um, Crest and two fifty off the Colgate. So that was a really good deal. And I think there was another receipt, but I don't have it up here, where I got um, a Crest, two Colgate, actually it was two Colgate, uh, uh, no, take that back. I got these indicator brushes, because these were, remember, on sale a few weeks back. Anyway, I got the ones where they were $4.99 and they were giving you a $5 extra care buck back. I got two of these. 
Um, I also got two of the Sally Hansen. I use that three off 15 on cosmetics and as well as two of those $3 off of one coupons that we got last Sunday. And two of those. And I also got two uh, more salon paws. Um, out of my coupons, there's a dollar off coupon that you can use on these indicator brushes from Crest and uh, the three dollar coupon on that. Um, after my bucks and everything, I still was able to get twenty five dollars back, which made it a really, really awesome deal. So basically, the bucks that I put into it, I got it right back. And I took um, five dollars of those bucks plus a dollar that I already had, and I rolled it into these Quaker oats that you see right here these are also two for six at cvs as well and because of the food tax in my state if it zeroes out it zeroes out the tax so basically i rolled six dollars in bucks into this and i got these completely free after my books no tax at all which made it a really good deal uh, so that was a hundred percent saving so going back over here if you look at all the receipts we didn't have any less than 90, uh, at least 94% savings today, which is awesome, awesome, awesome. The reason we always emphasize rolling those bucks because it saves you so much money. Anyway, guys, these are some of the deals that we were able to get. Thank you for liking, subscribing, and watching the videos. Also, on the Renews It, this is another transaction. Uh, we bought three Renews It's and one of these Maxwell House coffees. These are $2.99 in uh, CVS this week. If you have that dollar coupon that we got recently, that'll make them $1.99 after the coupon. Plus the Renews It coupon, that's a dollar as well. And if you have any um, other, you know, CVS coupons to go with it or a book like on this transaction, it was only $0.97 cents before a tax. Uh, 25 cent tax and 10 cent on that. So it's a dollar 32 for a thing of Maxwell House coffee and three renews. It's that's still a really good deal. Anyway, guys, these are just some of the deals that I was able to score today. I still walked out of the store with pretty much most of the bucks that I walked in there with. And uh, so, like I said, it's a really good week to try to stock up on groceries, even at CVS, not just toothpaste or renews it or nail polish or you know pain relief as far as the nail pa salon pause make sure you roll those bucks into something that you could use these are four pound canisters of sugar which is awesome and you don't have to go to a grocery store and spend actual money if you have bucks these are 42 ounces of oats that i love i mean that a lot of people might like too like I said, if you have the bucks roll into it it's a good week to stock up on some groceries at cvs anyway guys Thank you for liking, subscribing, and watching. I appreciate you all. I'll be, and my mom will be back later in the week with a coupon matchup for you. Uh, have a blessed week. Be a blessing to somebody else. It's Cheryl, that girl. Bye, friends.